Hi guys, and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm in my bathroom, which is new. This is new, but I'm talking about skincare as you guys can see. So I thought it was only fitting that I would be in the place where I uh have to do skincare. I, uh, I'm really excited for this video because skincare is something that I'm very, very passionate about. I've been on YouTube for years and years now and you guys have seen my skin go, go through some crazy changes. Uh, I know what it's like to feel super insecure and down on yourself when your skin isn't just feeling right, looking right, um, at least to what you feel comfortable in and I get that and I want to help. Um, so basically, I'm gonna film a whole skincare video like with before and after photos, I'm gonna do the whole shebang. But today, I'm going to be talking about travel. Um, because you guys have seen me travel a lot to these past few years. Traveling is something that I love, it's something that I'm prioritizing while I'm still young. It just makes me so happy. Um, but what doesn't make me happy is how my skin looks when I travel. And now I feel like I've finally figured out a skincare routine that helps me prevent breakouts. I still get breakouts all the time here and there, um, but it's not like my whole face is suffering uh, and I'm really taking care of it when I travel because I don't want it to look bad. I'm on camera all the time, um, if not here on my Instagram taking photos uh, or stories or something like that. I will even check bags uh, so I can bring all of these products because I just think it's so important uh, to maintain your skincare routine, especially while traveling. So this first product I'm really excited about because this is one of my holy grail products. Uh, it is something I've mentioned in, mentioned in favorites videos before. It is something that I find so important when it comes to my skincare routine, more so than even just travel, uh, which is more exciting to say that Clinique is actually partnering with me on this uh, because like, I love this. In my opinion, it's one of their best products and it is the Clinique Take the Day Off. And this thing is so cool. Basically, it's a makeup remover, but so much better. It is a balm, so it looks like this. And basically when you bring it into your hand, it kind of melts away into like this oil and it takes off all your makeup, um, but it doesn't feel like super greasy. It doesn't dry out your skin. It does it so well. It takes off your eye makeup, your face makeup, all the nasty like sunscreen residue. Uh, it is just one of the best, best products uh, ever. And I really stress to use this. A uh, little backstory, one of the things that was really making my skin break out was the fact that I wasn't taking off my makeup beforehand and I know you probably think that's crazy but honestly I didn't know that. I tried a few other things like this in the past but this has just been my favorite for forever now. So what's really cool is if you guys want to try this out without buying the full thing, Clinique is actually having a promotion right now. All of the month of July uh, you guys will get a sample of Take the Day Off and a liquid face soap with the purchase of any Clinique cleanser or makeup remover. So now that we have our makeup off, uh, the next thing we're going to talk about is cleansers. And uh, this is again something super important. It's one of those things that I would rather spend my money on good face facial products than uh, a bunch of clothing. So uh, this cleanser right now is one that I'm using. I'm going to be talking about so many cleansers in a skincare video of all my favorites, drugstore and high end. This one is high end. It is a Lancer skincare. This one I've tried a bunch. I actually read up that Ariana Grande used this. So I was like, she looks flawless. I'm going to try it. Uh, I really like it for my skin. It's good because I have sensitive skin, so it doesn't feel super harsh. Um, I like this cleanser, but this isn't a travel size, so it's a little annoying if I'm just bringing a carry-on. So if, if I'm bringing a carry-on, I will get the travel size of the Malin and Getz, I think is how you say it, or Goats, I'm not sure. Uh, grapefruit cleanser. It looks like this. Really cute, small, and it lasts usually for how long I'm traveling. Uh, so between those two, those are my favorites as of now. The next product I'm going to talk about is uh, exfoliant. And why I specifically like to bring this when I travel because is because uh, when I'm on planes, especially for a long period of time, lately I've been on planes for six plus hours, uh, my skin, I like, ew, it's just disgusting. Like, I hate how it feels. So what I want to do is just like scrub it all off. And most of my cleansers are smooth because they're for sensitive skin, so they don't have like that grainy texture, which really kind of like scrubs your face, which I definitely recommend doing because since I used to suffer from cystic breakouts, um, it's helping with like resurfacing my skin. So the product I really enjoy is the Dermalogica Daily Microfoliant. This is a really unique product. It kind of comes out like a powder. I believe it's a rice-based powder and it activates with water. So basically you just put a little bit into the palm of your hand, add water and it turns into this like grainy scrub and then you just go ahead and like scrub your whole face. And I'm not even kidding you, my skin actually feels like it's taking a breath when I'm done using this. 
Um, you use this after your cleanser and my skin like feels so good. I love it, especially when I travel. So this next product is definitely more of like a pamper product. It's something that I use in my everyday skincare routine. I don't need it for a week long when I travel, but if I'm checking a bag, I will bring it because it is part of my everyday skincare routine and I try not to break it as much as I can. Um, but it is the SK2 Facial Treatment Essence. I only use this in, a, in the morning. They just use like a cotton pad, put a little bit on and then wipe it all over my face. This really helps with the appearance of my skin. Again, this is just me kind of fixing my skin from my breakouts uh, that left scars. So this is really helping clear that area. But like I said, this is just something I wanted to mention. It's not something that I bring every single time when I travel, especially if I'm only doing carry-on because this would not work and I don't want them taking it because it's the best. All right, now let's talk about toner because toner is something I never used. And you might be thinking this is crazy, but I swear to God, I didn't know this stuff before I really started talking to like facialists and people that could help me with my skin. I never used to use a toner day and night, but it is very important. Um, and I say that because I've seen how it works and how it's fixed, fixed my skin. So this one's by SkinCeuticals. I love this skincare brand so much. This is the Conditioning Solution Gentle Exfoliating Toner. Um, it ha it's for normal or oily skin, which is perfect because that's literally my skin combo. I don't have dry skin at all. I'm like getting oily as I'm talking. Um, but basically toners are just really important. This one I like, you just spray it into a cotton pad, wipe it all over your face. I like this one specifically too because I can transfer this. It's a little bit gone, but if I'm just bringing a carry-on, I can transfer this into a plastic container that you get at like Target or CVS. Um, those little travel mini things because you don't need a lot of it when you use it. Now, serums, uh, I have a love-hate. It's one of those things that I'm like, do these things really work? Because they're expensive and most ser serums, I'm like, is this just something that like I'm paying for and it's not actually doing something because I'm using so much already? But I really like it, um, which is why I'm going to mention it. It is the Origins Mega Mushroom Relief and Resilience Advanced Face Serum. Um, this stuff I recently started using. I think I've been using this for a month or so, maybe a little bit more. This is great because it helps with removing redness and it also is really moisturizing to the skin. Um, besides the fact that I want to scrub my skin off <laughs> when I get off of planes, uh, it is also pretty dry and especially for me with oily skin, that is weird. Um, but I know my skin is going to break out if I don't do something quick. So having serums is another really important thing for me. I really, really like this one. Next up, we got moisturizers. Okay, moisturizers are super crucial. I swear if you just bring the, take the day off and, uh, or if you're blessed with good skin or don't need all of this like me, um, you just need to take the day off a cleanser and some moisturizer and you're good to go or sunscreen, which I'm gonna talk about in a second. So moisturizer, one of my favorites, just like regular day-to-day -day moisturizer is this one by Malin and Getz or Goats. I'm not sure, how do you say that, do you know? So this is the vitamin E face moisturizer really good i always have found that moisturizers like i always used to think moisturizers broke me out and i think it was just the type of moisturizers i was using so i'm really selective when it comes to my moisturizer i don't want it making me feel greasy i don't want my makeup to look gross after i apply it over a moisturizer um so this one i found i really really love so along the same lines of a moisturizer which is also really important because traveling can just really take a toll on your skin um, is some sort of sunscreen. This is the Hydro Boost Water Gel Lotion um, with SPF 50 by Neutrogena. I just recently started using this. I like it. Um, I basically use it underneath my makeup and it's good. Face sunscreen is very important, especially if you want to stay youthful um, uh, because wrinkles and sunspots and also just protecting yourself from the skin is just very crucial. Okay, we're almost done, I promise. Um, this is another one of those You're Being Extra products. Uh, it is an eye cream, and I swear I only bring eye creams when I'm traveling, um, which I should probably use them more because, you know, I'm 27 now and, you know, I gotta protect my wrinkles and all of that. I, when I travel, I am tired like 24-7 because I just do the most. I probably just got off of a red eye. I'm like running around being a tourist, filming. I'm taking the most photo and video I ever take. So, you know, I'm trying to look good. And this one is the Madeline and Getz Goats, who knows at this point, um, revitalizing eye gel. I like it, it's supposed to be hydrating and energizing. So I'm, I'm buying into it, I really like it um, so far, but this isn't one of those like, like I mentioned some Holy Grail products. This one's still new to me. I tried a bunch of eye creams and like, it's always hard to say, um, but I do like this one. All right, we have come to the end, my friends. 
Finally, I swear, our whole suitcase is gonna be filled with skincare if I keep talking. I have face masks. Uh, these things I like to bring along, especially when I'm on long flights. Yes, I'm kind of that crazy person that will put on a face mask mid flight and look like I'm gonna kill you. I think they're really important. Uh, I get a bunch of these from Face Story. Um, they send me a bunch and they're amazing. I think that they're really great masks. I have so many, I can't even like narrow down a brand that I like. I just do like whatever sheet mask I find. I do some that clarifying. Mainly I bring moisturizing ones when I travel because like I said, the airplanes suck the life out of my face. So moisturizing is crucial. Uh, so yeah, face masks are really easy to pack also. They're really easy to pack, which is great. And we're done, yay. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really hope you guys liked it. Whether you travel or not, I really hope you found this helpful. Uh, give it a thumbs up if you want a full skincare video, like before and after pictures, uh, yikes, because I just wanna help you guys out and I will do that for you. Uh, so thanks again for watching. Again, I really hope you enjoyed. Thanks to Clinique again for sponsoring this video. Uh, I really, really do love that product. So I hope you guys do too if you try it out. Uh, but yeah, I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.